Matt Kuchar's decision to be the only player to finish his final round on Monday at the 2024 Wyndham Championship was both surprising and controversial, capturing the attention of the golfing world. The unusual circumstances unfolded at Sedgefield Country Club in Greensboro, North Carolina, where weather delays had already wreaked havoc on the tournament schedule. The Wyndham Championship, the final regular season event before the FedEx Cup playoffs, was plagued by severe weather throughout the week. Tropical Storm Debbie dumped over five inches of rain on the course on Thursday, forcing the postponement of the first round to Friday. Another storm on Friday night delayed play again on Saturday. As a result, the 36-hole cut wasn't made until Sunday morning, with 67 players advancing to the final two rounds. These players had to play at least 36 holes on Sunday, with only a short break in between and a split tee start to try to complete the tournament before nightfall. Kucher, a veteran player and former FedEx Cup champion, was facing immense pressure. As the only player to qualify for every FedEx Cup playoff since its inception in 2007, he needed a win at Wyndham to keep that streak alive. After leading the tournament at the 36-hole mark with a score of 12 under par, Kucher found himself in contention going into the final round. However, as the day wore on, his chances of winning began to slip away. By the time he reached the 18th hole, Kucher was 11 under par and tied for 12th place, effectively out of the running for the title. As darkness approached, the tournament was racing against time to crown a winner. Kucher's group, which included Aaron Rye, who was vying for his first PGA Tour victory, didn't tee off in the final round until 3.21 p.m. E.T. With daylight fading, the pressure was on to finish before darkness set in. Despite this, Kucher made a curious decision on the 18th hole. After driving his ball into the pine straw 212 yards from the flag, he opted to mark his ball and wait to finish his round the next day, citing the lack of light as the reason. Kucher's decision meant that the tournament's official conclusion would be delayed until Monday morning, even though his score couldn't impact the outcome. Aaron Rye had already secured his first PGA Tour win, but the tournament couldn't officially end until Kucher completed his round. This left many wondering why Kucher, who had been anxious to finish earlier, suddenly decided to hold off. In an interview with Golf Channel's Todd Lewis, Kucher explained that his decision was partly influenced by a desire to set an example for fellow competitor Max Grazerman, who had endured a disastrous quadruple bogey on the 14th hole that effectively took him out of contention. Kucher expressed concern that continuing to play in near darkness might have led to further mistakes. I was trying to set an example for Max, Kucher said. We were so far past where we should have stopped playing. We saw what Max did on hole 16. They should have blown the horn there. I feel bad, the poor kid should have won this tournament. By me not playing, it may show Max he has an important shot to hit. 